Hello and welcome to Interactive CAD and Tech. Um, today as part of my common SOLIDWORKS question series, today I'm going to show you how to change the units on a part. Uh, there's a couple of ways you can do it. At the minute I've got this set to millimetres, grams, seconds. So just to show you, I'm just going to go to my first boss extrude and go to the sketch. You can see it's 50 mil by 50 mil and 100 mil deep. Sorry, it's 200 mil deep because I've mirrored it. So from there, I'm going to just go up to the cog, go to document properties, units, and change it to inch, pounds, and seconds. You can customize it and select your own for each um, each kind of dimension. So you can have different ones for mass properties and so on. So just click OK on that. If I go back to this exact same sketch, I've made no changes. It's now in inches. Another quick way to change it, if you're changing um, units a lot, is just down at the bottom where it says custom here. You can change it and just go to back to meters. And we're going to go back to meters, milligrams, and seconds. To change the units on your measure tool, if you go to evaluate and I go to measure at the minute, this is in millimeters. You can click the units and precision here and change it. So you can have uh, pretty much anything you want. I could do it in feet if I really wanted to. So that's not point no, sorry, no, not point six six foot, which also comes in handy. And it's same with the degrees as well. In your angular units, you can change it to radians. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have, please subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.